Hello, in this video, I am going to show you how to use cheat codes on your Delta emulator. So for emulators like the N64, Nintendo DS, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, well, NES and SNES, no, got you covered. So I'll be doing it for N64, but the principle is you know, exactly the same. You know, it's cheat codes. It's just, you know, a, you know, a string of, you know, numbers and I think letters, well, but they numbers definitely. Um, they, they just import and, you know, you, you get the cheat code. So first of all, if we just, you know, if we just look at the iPhone portion, well, launch up a game. So you have to launch up a game first. So Super Mario 64, for example. If I click the menu button, the cheat codes option. And I'm going to remove this cheat code because this is what we'll be adding. To add one, you click the plus in the top right and you name your cheat code. You can name it whatever you want and you select the type of cheat code it is. This is not like a drop down or like a pop up thing. There are other types of cheat code systems for that console. They'll just appear left to right. So in this case for the N64, it's only Game Shark. You will literally name it like name. Then down here, you put, you know, the code and that will be it and then you would you know click save and then you can activate it but let me just show you that you know they all have they, they do all have cheat codes available or the systems so this is game genie and game shock again the format will be slightly different and that's it like there's nothing more to it than that so what i will actually do i'll provide different websites for all of the different game you know cheat systems depending on which one you want to use you might have a preference so in this case it's game shark but i'll provide websites for all of them so if i go back to super mario n64 I go to menu i'm going to actually load the state first and now that we've loaded this and i'm going to go to menu cheat codes click plus now what i'm going to do is a search for the game. Uh, so in the case of this Game Shark website, if you have another website too or somewhere to grab your cheat codes, feel free to do that. But I'm gonna click plus, I'm gonna search I'm in, type in Super Mario 64, it's actually there, but I'm just gonna search it for it anyway. And this is not the DS version, so we want this Super Mario 64 right here. Here you go, we have the codes right here, and there's some functional effect codes. You know, there's all you know the different types of codes. The one I'll be doing the black and white backgrounds just because that's super easy and simple to demonstrate that it's working, but you know, you can do which one you whichever one you want. Now I'm gonna name it, so I'm just gonna call it B and W backgrounds. Now for the code, it's eight double zero, eight double zero seven. C five three one, and you don't need to put the space. It will automatically put that in. It will automatically format it for you. And I'm gonna click save, and as you can see, there's a tick next to it. If I click the B and the B back, you know this cheat, it removes the tick. So you can actually enable it and disable it whilst the game is running. So if I enable it, here we go. Go back to resume. You'll see that the background in you know in the back has now changed to black and white. I'll show you. So if I go to menu, cheat codes. Disable that if you just look at the clouds in the right of the background, they'll go back to color. So that's how you use cheat codes. Like I said, I'll be doing it for all the different emulators, or more specifically, the different types of cheat systems out there. So, like, there's a Game Genie, there's Game Shark, there's a bunch of others as well. I'll show you how to use all of them for the cheat codes. I'm if you're tired. wondering, oh, how do I actually set up? Delta emulator to play all of these, you know, games. It's really easy, really simple to use. It's on the app store. There's a few new ones with like with certain ones with bars files and you know where to organize and put your ROMs. Don't worry, I've got you covered. I'm gonna have a video. There'll be a link in the description to a full comprehensive guide of how to actually do this. So feel free, feel free to check that out. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. If you have any questions, like you know, there's a particular game you can't find cheat codes for it. You know, you're struggling the, the links that i provided aren't you know helping literally just comment i will you know help you out and i'll get the cheat codes that you are looking for so that's it look forward to seeing you in the next video take care bye